Hi. Welcome back to the VIS video tutorials. Today, we will see how to perform the deflection check of reinforced concrete beams, according to the provisions of Eurocode 2. The code allows for two different approaches. A direct approach, based on the numerical integration of curvatures, at discrete locations along the members. And an indirect approach, based on the limitation of span to depth ratios. The first, requires a nonlinear cracked analysis to be performed, accounting for members cracking, internal forces redistribution, rotations at ends, shrinkage and long-term effects. On the contrary, the latter can readily be applied, in the form of simple parametric equations. For this reason, the direct method is usually limited to the analysis of non-standard cases, or when an explicit calculation of the deflection is required. While the indirect method, is instead employed in most practical cases. This currently implements the indirect method, which is calibrated to limit the total deflection of the members, to a 250th of the span, and the deflection after construction, to a 500th of the span. As mentioned, this is done by limiting the span to depth ratio, according to the following code equation. The base span to depth ratio is first calculated, as a function of the concrete class, and of the reinforcing demand on the member. Then, the appropriate correction factors which account for restraint conditions, steel stresses, span length and flange dimension, are determined. At this point, the maximum allowable span to depth ratio is obtained, and can be compared with the actual value. Let's see an example. The program automatically identifies the restraint conditions of the member, and calculates all the related parameters accordingly. Finally, the actual span to depth ratio is compared with the limiting value, and the corresponding check is reported. Checks can be performed for all the elements at once, by clicking the check all command. Results can now easily be reviewed, in the form of color-coded contours plot, or in a compact, tabular format. Thank you for watching. To the next video.